Hey everybody, I'm Lisa Roberry, your independent Sensi consultant. Welcome back to my channel. What is better than hauling your own purchases? Hauling your husband's. <laughs> So we are gonna do that today. I got a couple of boxes the other day. One was addressed to him, one was addressed to me, and I was like, what the heck? <laughs> we are just gonna go ahead and haul both of these together. So um, they are opened, but I have not actually had a chance to dive all the way into the boxes just yet. So let's go ahead and let's start out with his. Why the heck not? So we've got our packaging here look at this guy okay <clears throat> so <laughs> i'm laughing because he got himself a pack of car bar clips in amazon rain so we have um we have several different scent delivery systems for your car or for on the go i myself prefer the car bars the one that actually hang from the rear view mirror or wherever you decide to hang them um my vents in my car i don't feel like these would work super great so i just don't use these and i just i prefer to have it hanging from my rear view mirror uh, my husband on the other hand actually prefers the scent circles because he likes to not have the scent be crazy strong although what i will say what i've said over and over and over again and i'll say till i'm blue in the face is that i feel like the newer scent circles within the last like year or two have been a lot stronger than in years past so he actually hangs his from the very back <laughs> well in his truck it does hang from from the mirror but in the vehicle that he takes every single day to work he ha he has it like a third row seating so he has it like hanging in his trunk of his suv kind of thing so he that's how like light he wants his scent so this kind of surprises me it also kind of makes me want to throw him a party just a little bit <laughs> because he's not clipping this to anything in the back of his car so Hmm. So I will be sure to report back on his thoughts and mine as well on the car bar clips. So we'll see. Let me know in the comments if you have given these a try, what your thought, what your thoughts are, if you like these better than the car bars that hang, or if you like these better than the scent circles maybe. So these tend to last longer, the car bars or the car bar clips tend to last longer than the scent circles. They last months. I think these say they'll last like... Car bar clip delivers fragrance for up to 30 days. Um, I don't know about the car bar clips because I haven't used them personally, but the car bars themselves definitely last longer than 30 days. I would say maybe eight weeks even, like six to eight weeks. Um, they, they last pretty well. Now that will vary depending on the scent that you choose, but I'm pretty happy with the car bars. So, and this is essentially the same thing, but it just, it has a clip. So it comes with the clips. You just put the little clips, attach it to the back there. Um, these are sealed separately. So if you don't want to use both of them, you don't have to you just cut around the like seal and only use one at a time. If you'd like to get the maximum to maximize like your usage of this. Oh, geez. How long am I going to talk about car bar clips? <laughs> I am long-winded, and then this does not surprise me. So, <laughs> he's so funny. <clears throat> he uh, purchased the mini warmer of the USC Trojans here, and you know what? We're going to unbox it, and I didn't even ask him. <laughs> That's okay. He still loves me. Oh, how cool, and the top of it says fight on. Fight on. That's awesome. <laughs> So this is really cool. If you haven't had a chance to check out, we do have collegiate warmers. Some of them are full size, some of them are minis. We actually do have the full size of the USC warmer. That one is no longer available, the full size one, but uh, he saw this mini. So from time to time, he will go onto my website. <laughs> he will just peruse and see what's available because he doesn't trust me to deliver information to him anymore because um, I lost that privilege <laughs> because, uh, let's see, what was it? I think the first thing was not telling him that Blue Grotto came in a body wash and he found out when he went to his mom's house. Um, yeah, I got reprimanded for that. <laughs> and then, um, not telling him that Oodles of Orange was being retired because he was like, yeah, go ahead and order me some of this. And I was like, oh yeah, so that's not a thing anymore. <laughs> 
almost found myself in divorce court. So uh, he just he peruses the website from time to time himself because he doesn't trust me. So uh, this was one of those things he saw and he was like, what? How come you didn't tell me? I was like, because we have a full size one. Where are you going to put this? I'm going to take it to work. Okay, great. So let's go ahead and open it. <laughs> so let's see. I should have grabbed the full size so that you can see what the full size looks like. So with all of our mini warmers, you do get the plug in base that comes with it and the 15 watt light bulb that comes with it. <clears throat> and then you will get your shade or the warmer itself. So it's the perfect Trojan red here. And then it's got the USC logo and Trojans. So that's nice. I'm happy for him. <laughs> I asked him, I was like, do you want a tabletop base if you're going to take it to work? Or, hey, you know what? I'm not going to push it. And I, I am not making fun of him at all. I love it. In fact, it warms my heart so much that he wants to take this to work. Because um, he already has one at work, I think. And so the fact that he wants a second one, I'm like, absolutely. Let's do this. <laughs> Tell me what you need. I'll get you hooked up. So that is his little haul. He got his mini warmer and his car bar clips. Good for you, Sean. I love you. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's see what damage I did here. More packing tape. Packing paper. Packing paper. Okay. A big old box for a 15 watt bulb. <laughs> There's obviously more in there than that. But every once in a while, like I just, I like to kind of take inventory of what bulbs I have on hand. If you're a consultant yourself, or even if you're not, just take inventory of what bulbs you have on hand. You always want to make sure you've got one extra one um, on hand, just in case you have a burnout situation. Um, and if your consultant is not local, um, then you always want to make sure you've got like one on hand. So at least one. And we've got some bars here pretty soon i'm in california and i'm assuming i'm thinking pretty soon they're gonna need to start sending some ice packs with our bars here because i'm i always get nervous right around this time of year because it's starting to warm up a little bit not like a crazy amount but where the ups guy leaves my boxes in direct sunlight and i'm just like always leaves me a little bit nervous okay uh so i picked up a blue grotto for myself i grabbed a, a six pack here got a blue grotto this is really lovely um what is it my girlfriend told me that this is i don't know if she said if it was a dupe or if it was just very very similar if you are uh familiar with capri blue volcano it's a candle i, I think it may even be just like a general fragrance anyway but capri blue volcano this is apparently very similar to that um it's very tropical fruity and it's a really nice strong fragrance as well so oh that's really really good and my husband loves this so that is blue grotto should i tell you what scentsy says why not <laughs> blue grotto a bestseller for good reason run away with fresh tropical notes sweet citrus and lush botanicals i wouldn't really call this i know it just says botanicals but like I don't find this to be floral at all. It's really just very tropical fruity. It's really nice. So Blue Grotto. Next, I picked up a Berry Bright. And the reason for this is because I picked up two bars to be able to warm entirely downstairs. And then my husband, if you didn't already see my what I was warming video, um, <laughs> the we're all mad here scent inspired by Alice in Wonderland uh it's a little bit of a powerhouse so my husband um recommended <laughs> that I not have the entire scent going all throughout the downstairs so I did a little bit of mixing so the scent that I like had mingling with it was very bright so uh, I still really want to warm this one entirely downstairs entirely all in one space because it's really nice this just reminds me of blue raspberry cotton candy oh it's so good it's so sweet it's so nice and i i'm happy with the performance on this do i wish it would last a little bit longer yes but honestly i'm i'm happy i'm content with it it lasted more than a day so i'm happy with that so 
very bright. I grabbed one of those. One of my beloved strawberry rose. In fact, I just looking at this made me remember that I need to check and make sure it's in my Scentsy Club because <clears throat> I have a feeling like after this month, it's probably going to sell out. So this is the scent of the month for February 2020. And with the scents of the month that are not featured in the permanent seasonal catalog, they do have a tendency and can sell out. They're only while supplies last. So if there is a scent that you really like, if it's a scent of the month, it can potentially sell out. So just consider yourself warned. This one is just a really, really nice strawberry scent. Very, very subtle hint of floral, but it's not, I wouldn't even call it rose. Like rose is such a specific and powdery floral scent that I just don't know. I don't pick up rose at all. It's just more of an authentic kind of earthy strawberry scent. It's so beautiful and I can't say enough about this. Oh, if you love like an authentic, like you stick a strawberry in front of your face and you like the way it smells, try this. I think you'll really like it. It's really, really nice. They did such a good job with this one. So strawberry rose, picked that up. Another one. <laughs> Two strawberry rose. You can't have enough of this scent. Oh, um, I also picked up another jammy time scent. So once again, if you saw my what I was warming video, um, <clears throat> I tried this in the bedroom and I actually didn't like it in the bedroom only because we do all of our laundry with the jammy time scent in the laundry line. So I just felt like I wasn't I wasn't smelling the wax because <laughs> even though it's this is a nice, decent performer. I just, I just felt like I was smelling my bedding. <laughs> so I am going to try warming this in a different area of the house. So I'm thinking like laundry room, bathroom, that sort of thing. So um, that's jammy time. And this is a really, really good sweet floral. It's so nice. This is, it's like lavender and sweet pea. I think there's freesia in this as well, but I also get this like comforting feeling of, and it's, it's, definitely the lavender that like makes me feel comfortable, but um, also like this like sweetness or comforting note of chamomile I pick out. It's not in the scent description, but I get that personally. Let me tell you what Scentsy says. Um, Jamie time, drift into dreamland with baby freesia, lavender, and sweet pea. So this is a sweet floral. And it's so nice, I love it. It's so like comforting, like I said. And then I also picked up a Camu Camu bar. This is crazy tropical fruity as well. Um, I don't know what a Camu Camu fruit smells like, but I feel like I wanna bite it. <laughs> it just smells so incredibly sweet and tropical, almost like, almost along the lines of like a melon, like it's almost, like a melon, apple, pear kind of concoction. Oh, it smells so good. Love this. Crazy good performer. Perfect for summertime. You'll imagine you're on a beach with this thing. I'm telling you. Uh, Camu Camu, tropical oasis of lush mandarin, Camu Camu, and passion fruit. So my sniffer's a little bit off here, <laughs> but it's okay. It's just tropical fruity and it is delightful. So that is Camu Camu. <clears throat> what else do we have in here? Some new products. Yes. So I picked up mm -hmm, mm -hmm, part of one of the new fragrances to the cleaning line is Johnny Appleseed. Mm -hmm. If you love a good apple fragrance all year round give johnny appleseed a try is it just smells like apples it's so good there's no like spice note to it or anything it's just apples um so i picked this up in the dish soap <clears throat> and if you didn't see my tuesday tip video from was it a couple weeks ago now um i actually save if you have pumps from the laundry line <clears throat> apparently the scent soft thanks for the tip you guys uh the scent soft pump is a little bit longer so <clears throat> you can use the pump from either the scent soft or the laundry liquid and use it in that if you're going to use the laundry liquid uh, make sure you save this top as well uh, because it stops just like 
a little bit short it's like stops like right about here so you're going to want to keep this lid so that you're not wasting this amount of product so um i just uh opened up my last dish soap so i was really glad to pick this one up i actually should have picked up some more so next order goes in i'll definitely be picking up more but we'll see how i like the johnny apple seed we'll see <clears throat> i also picked up the uh all-purpose cleaner in johnny apple seed i love our all-purpose cleaner it's uh the concentrate i keep forgetting to say that the all-purpose cleaner concentrate so you mix like one part of this make 16 ounce bottles let's see here i don't follow directions i just like i pour this i just like eyeball it but there are actual instructions on this here it's like one part you do one part of this and then the rest water <clears throat> i think i probably mix like two parts of this let's see here dilute one part all-purpose cleaner concentrate with three parts water so yeah exactly what i was what i was saying but i think i do more like two parts um and something else that i wanted to mention because i did mention the counter clean i also got the counter clean and johnny appleseed so i love the counter clean i use it on seriously like 99 percent of everything in my life <laughs> carpets rugs um stainless steel appliances tile literally like everything shoes everything 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 this does an amazing job at cleaning and freshening i hate it on my counters <laughs> i know that's so silly because it is counter clean but this i hate it on my countertops um and the reason for that is because it leaves this like film on my counters now I should say my kitchen counters because I actually like this in my bathrooms because in my bathrooms I have tile countertops so this works just fine for the tile there's no like I don't see a film I don't feel the film nothing like that it feels nice and clean but on my granite countertops in the kitchen I hate this because I can see the film <laughs> and so I'm just like I need it to look shiny <laughs> I need it to look really shiny and um it's not like it's a thick film that you can feel or anything it's just you can see it and I know that what that is it's actually placing a barrier on your surfaces I don't want that barrier there I don't so I don't like this for that I use it for literally everything else so what I use for my countertops is actually the all-purpose cleaner concentrate. This does amazing on my granite countertops. I absolutely love it. Um, and a little bit goes a long way. So like this huge bottle here, you're going to get several uses out of this. So I think it was this. Yeah, we got this at World Tour last year. And so we actually had two bottles of it that lasted me a year so that did really good so we got two full bottles this is 24 fluid ounces and that lasted me a year so two of those bottles so this is definitely going to last you a long time if you're mixing it appropriately so and it does a great job at cleaning and it smells amazing so love this stuff so i'm excited to try it in the johnny Appleseed. is that everything that is everything so that is our haul <laughs> that is that is Sean's haul and my own haul. So let me know if you have given the new Johnny Appleseed cleaning products a try. I am really interested to know your thoughts on it. Let me know if you have tried some of the new spring and summer scents. I would love to know. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new, please subscribe. Otherwise, I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.